Well, the 2024 Season 2 schedule has been released. And let's take a look at it. Let's see what's racing in the comments down below. Let me know what you're going to be racing. We'll start off, as always, with the Oval Series. We'll skip the rookies. We'll head the D-Class right away. Uh, Arca, definitely going to be racing that. Homestead, Iowa, The Rock, Charlotte 2018, Southern National. Uh, that's going to be chaos, but that's going to be a lot of fun. Definitely looking forward to that one. Auto Club, IRP, Daytona. Looks like it's the current edition Daytona. Old Atlanta, the Charlotte Roval, which is pretty cool. Uh, Bristol, and ending the season at Legacy, Texas. That's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, Cars Tour. All right here, Southern National, Sobo, Slinger. That'll be interesting. USA, Martinsville, Oxford Plains, North Wilkesboro, Myrtle Beach. Kern is going to be fun. Lanier, Langley, all that sort of thing. Draftmaster, not my cup of tea at all whatsoever. But, oh well. Um, looks like they're at iRacing Super Speedway for the first four weeks with different cars between next gen, 87s, trucks, and Legacy Cot. It not really my thing, so just going to skip over that one. SK Mods. Uh, I believe this is going to be for both the fixed and the open. All these are 40 laps. New Smyrna, Oxford Plains, Concord, Bullring, Thompson, Slinger, Langley, Stafford, Southern National, Myrtle Beach. Typical, uh, typical short track stuff, so that should be fun. Uh, this is also the SK series, the open versus fixed. SRX, this is going to be fun. I'm looking forward to racing this for sure. Stafford, Lucas Oil, which is this... Is that dirt, or is that... I might actually have to buy this dirt track. Um, Lucas Oil, Sobo, Knoxville, Slinger, Nashville Fairgrounds, Cedar Lake, another dirt track, Five Flags, Eldora, IRP, I-55, North, North Wilkesboro, so half dirt oval, half regular oval. I still think that's going to be a, an interesting one. We'll see how much of that I race, especially with the dirt stuff. I'm not a dirt driver, but this could be fun. Take a look now at the C-Class stuff, Advanced Legends. Probably not going to race them, but here is the schedule in front of you, depending on when. I may or may not race them, but looks like if there's a road course, definitely racing it. Oh, Orin Park. That should be fun. But the rest just ovals. Cars Tour again. Same deal. Gen 4 Cup. Probably not going to race that. Uh, just because it goes off at weird times for me. Kansas, Darlington, Homestead, Nashville, Sonoma, 2018, Charlotte Oval, all that. IndyCar Series, that is back on the menu. Iowa, Charlotte, Kentucky, Auto Club, that's going to be chaos. Nashville, Homestead, Old Pocono, Chicagoland, Old Phoenix, current Texas, and Indy. Ends up the week of, uh, last week of May. See fixed. Looks like is following the truck series for the most part. Bristol go to Chicagoland voice crack apparently um, Martinsville, Texas Talladega, Dover, Kansas uh, Darlington, North Wilkesboro Charlotte 18 and Gateway, all races that I'll probably wind up doing in some capacity 
tour mods nothing really too special here going to be racing all of them as well they are racing at slinger so that should be something that's just nis we can skip nis that's also nis it's the fix series Even more NIS. Okay, street stocks, not going to be racing them. But typical short track kind of schedule. Same with super lates. And we'll jump in the B class. Here's the Xfinity series, the Fix series. Auto Club next week. Coda, Richmond, Martinsville, Texas, Talladega, Dover. It's all the same... Uh, as NASCAR. Road America in there, Charlotte Oval, Nashville Fairgrounds. 87s, I want to try to race them a little bit more. Uh, haven't really had much of a chance to race them this year, but I really want to get back into them. Legacy Texas, Legacy Daytona, Auto Club, Legacy Charlotte, North Wilkesboro, Kansas... Old Pocono. They're going to be at Stafford this year, which is really cool. Talladega, Watkins Glen Classic, Martinsville, and ending it at Rockingham. That's a good schedule. I'm looking forward to doing that. That's just Xfinity Open. Silver Crown. Don't race that, even though I've always wanted to. Same with Sprints. And now we'll get to the NASCAR stuff. A open, same series as A fixed. Obviously, it follows all the NASCAR stuff, so we can kind of breeze through, but it's the typical. Uh, looks like NASCAR is off. So Atlanta is going to go there. Is that really current Atlanta going back to current Atlanta after racing there like three weeks ago? All right. Uh, Coda, Richmond, Bristol. Martinsville, Talladega, Dover, Kansas, Darlington, current Texas, current Charlotte, and Gateway to round out the season. A fix is the exact same. Dirt Oval is something I'm skipping. Okay, it's all dirt, dirt, dirt. Dirt Road, again, something I'm skipping. And now the sports car stuff, because this year, new to iRacing, they swapped out the road, I rating and safety rating, and now you have a sports car class and an open wheel class. Anything open wheel is going to be open wheel. Anything not open wheel is considered a sports car. So, Rookie Mazda's... Golden Ticket series. Don't know anything about that. It's the old Mazda. It's restricted to select members. Don't know what that's going to mean. Uh, that's right. This is a new series uh, for the season. The BMW M Power Tour. It's using different BMWs at different tracks. So the first week is uh, the LMDH or the GTP of uh, BMW Hybrid at Sebring constant weather uh, the Nürburgring for the M4 GT4 bringing back the L the legacy Z4 GTEs all the BMW is going to be racing here so that's going to be interesting Clio Cup not something I race but could be fun Oh, Snetterton 100. That's the short infield circuit, I believe. Ferrari Challenge, not racing there. GR Cup. This is my baby. I love this car. I love the series. Let's see what the, uh, the schedule looks like. So, Lednan. Track that we have not really raced on much. Brands Hatch Grand Prix. Winton. Going back to Winton in a long time. I haven't raced there since it first came out. Osterschleben. Uh, wow. 
Okay. Uh, Brazil, but using the Moto layout. Sebring International, using the Moto layout for Daytona, where it kind of cuts the horseshoe and cuts back onto the backstretch. Long Beach, Road Atlanta, Snetterden 300, so the full circuit of Snetterden. Sandown and ending the season at Mount Panorama. That is going to be a very, very fun season. Uh, GT4 fixed. Alton Park. Sebring. Barber. Zandvoort. Road Atlanta. Imola. Motorland Aragon. Motorland Aragon, rather. Nürburgring combined. That's going to be fun. And I'm assuming this is going to be the exact same deal for the uh, the GT3 series. Or the uh, the sports car challenge, rather. Fanatec, don't really race that one, so we'll skip it. Mission R, again, we'll skip that. Mustang, skip. Production car challenge, another fun one. Uh, Okiyama, Watkins Glen Cup layout, Sandown, Snetterton 200 where it kind of skips the infield all together in just the outer ring. Summit Point, Most Sport, Donington, the Grand Prix Circuit, Rudskagen, Mid-Ohio with the Chicane, Brands Hatch, Osterschleben, and VIR North. Hmm. That should be an interesting one as well, especially with all the different cars and all that kind of stuff. Actually, real quick, I'm going to go back to the GR Cup to see what it says about weather. Just says constant weather, fixed sky. So this way it's going to rain or not rain the entire time, and no one really knows. That's very cool. Let's see. Mission R. Skip Barber, production car we already did. Spec Racer Ford. TCR Challenge. That's right, that's the new touring car series title. Uh, but we are at Summit Point, Sebring International, Donington Park National Circuit, Zanvoort, Charlotte Roval, Imola, Knock Hill. That's going to be fun. Laguna Seca, Road Atlanta Full Course, 24 hour, or the Nürburgring. Combined Circuit, Alton Park, and Mid-Ohio Full. Looks like the weekly series does not have their schedule or is not going to be going. MX-5 is not really going to be racing that. There it is, the Sports Car Challenge. And yeah, it's the same as the GT4 series. So, Alton Park, Sebring International, Barber... Zandvoort, Road Atlanta, Imola, Motorland Aragon, Motorcycle Circuit, Never and Combined, Algarve, WeatherTech, Spa, and Mid Ohio. So, no, it is different. Good, finally. That's the VRS Endurance Series. Not going to be racing that. Same with the Michelin Pilot Challenge. And the IMSA Vintage Series. Skipping the LMP3. My new favorite series. Proto GT Thrustmaster Challenge. Magello. Legacy Silverstone. Hockenheim. Road America. Barcelona Historic. Monza. Fuji. No Chicane. That'll be fun. Juan Carlos Play, Jose Carlos Place, Grand Prix, Nürburgring Combined, Brands Hatch, Watkins Glen Classic Boot, and ending the season at Mount Panorama. That's going to be terrifying, but also a ton of fun. Radical skipping that. Ringmeister skipping... Well, let's see what's racing. So Cadillac. Clio, Legere, 79, Honda Civic, 
M8 GTE. Stock Car Brazil. That's going to be fun. MX5, Corvette, Ferrari GT3, Radical, and the V. That's cool. Skipping that one. Skipping sports car or uh, supercars. This is the open version of TCR races, but exact same series. Porsche Cup, going to be skipping that one. GT Sprint Series. Algarve. Juan Carlos Place. Jose Carlos Place. Watkins Glen International. Road America. Monza. 24 Hours of Le Mans. Sebring. Red Bull. Mount Panorama. Nürburgring Combined. Suzuka. And Road Atlanta. That'll be fun. Probably skipping Nürburgring for that, only because I still use the driving line, but it is what it is. GT3 Fix is going to be the exact same as VRS. So, everything I just said, only 20-minute races. GTEs probably won't be racing those, but that is the schedule. Nothing really sticking out to, of it. It's an endurance series. More endurance stuff. LMP2, skipping that. And the A class, IMSA Racing. Constant weather. That's going to be at Suzuka, Sebring, Algarve, Imola, Road Atlanta, Long Beach. That's going to be fun, but also terrifying. Miguelo, Spa, that'll be fun. Laguna Seca is going to be tight. Indy is always fun. Misano and ending the season at Detroit Belle Isle, that's going to be cool too. And this is just the GTP, no, IMSA, oh, the Simsa fixed. 35 minutes. And Formula Cars, just the Ray... And the V's for the rookies. The D-Class, here's F4. Summit Point. Jose Carlos. Lime Rock. Road America. Willow Springs. All those fun ones. F4 Challenge. Probably not doing F4 or the Formula 1600. Don't own the Skippy. Probably not racing that one. That's the Formula A, like NIS version. F3 series, Super Formula Lights. Um, obviously, that's a typo. They're not going to be racing 300 laps. Uh, Road America, Hockenheim Grand Prix, Road Atlanta Full Course, Jill Villeneuve. That's going to be fun. Twin Ring Motegi is going to be another good one. Monza Hungaro Ring. Barcelona, Algarve, Suzuka, Coda, and the Glen. Yeah, that's going to be fun. Fix series also in there. It's probably not racing at the IndyCar series, but if I do, odds are I won't, but you know. Oh yeah, that's the uh, the open series anyway. Formula A, skipping all that. B class, Super Formula, not gonna race that yet. A little too powerful for me. Honestly, same with the Indy car. I might probably race some of the lower class races, but nothing. Uh, you know. Nothing super crazy. And then the unranked stuff. The Carburetor Cup. Delara Dash is back. Using the old DW12 car. Pickup Cup. Millbridge is going to be its own micro sprint series. And that's it. 
So let me know in the comments down below what you plan on racing, what series look interesting, and I'll uh, I'll see you out there racing, I'm sure. As always, if you like what you see, feel free to comment, like, subscribe, subscribe, all that fun YouTuber crap, and uh, I'll talk to you then. Thanks for watching.